I speak this with honor and privilege to the man of God that God created in his very own image. Even those tough things in the world that you may have faced, it still cannot take away the glory and honor God has rest upon your life. I know men are the most valiant and the most honorable creatures that God has created in his image. But man of God, you have to get back up and you have to believe the report of your creator. You are created by the king, so he gave you kingship. You are created by the ruler of all, so he gives you rule of your household. You are created by the lion of the tribe of Judah, so he gave you kingship among beasts. The ox is one of the strongest animals, so he gave you strength beyond measure. He know what he put into you, he knew what you were before the earth was. And he allowed you to be birthed through a Mary that's supposed to speak life back into you. But before Mary came along with his very finger and with the breath of his own being, he blew into you. Greatness that no one could take away from you. Through all the trials and tribulations, through all the warfares, through everything that this world may have said, through every bitter word that may have come from the heart of a broken woman. You are not that. You're what God says you are. He said you're the head, not the tail. He says you're above, not beneath. He said you are the lender, not the borrower. He said you are created fearfully and wonderfully in his image. So man of God, arise. There's a king in you. There's a royal priest in you. There's a headship in you that can only come from God. Stop trying to do this in your own strength and bow your knees and cry out to the Lord God that created you to be greatness in the earth. He came in the form of a man. So you can see the example as Jesus walked across the earth. Everything that's tried to damage you will work for you. Once you put it in your heart to become what God has spoken over your life. All those other things, allow him to heal your mind. Allow him to heal your heart. Allow him to restore a right spirit back in you. He determined greatness before the earth was. He determined sonship through the bloodship before the earth was. He determined husbandship before the earth was. He determined you to be a great father before the earth was. So the earth can't destroy you unless you allow it. Forgive every evil word that has been spoken into your hearing and every evil image that has taken away the manship or tried to break the manship that God created you to be. I am honored as a woman of God to be chosen to speak mighty words into God's very own image. He created, he formed, and he made it for greatness. Roar, man of God. There's a king lion inside of you over the house of Judah. So, in Jesus' name.